Welcome back, guys. I haven't seen you in a while face to face. I've done a couple Adobe tutorials, but I'm back. And today I want to talk about Airtable. Airtable has allowed me to organize my entire business. Airtable is like a spreadsheet, but it's like a spreadsheet on steroids. It's easy to use. You need no skills. You don't need to know how to do formulas and things like that that you would need to in uh, Google Sheets or in Microsoft Excel. Uh, the, basic, uh, the basic features of it are very easy to use. And like I said, I've been able to organize and run my entire business on this platform. And best of all, it is free. So when I get back, we're gonna just go into Airtable and I'm gonna show you um, how to use it, how to set it up, some of the cool features. I think you'll really like it. So be right back. Okay, so getting right into Airtable here. Uh, when you get signed up for it, and by the way, I do have a referral link down in the show notes, so you'll be able to click on that and then um, get signed up, and it's through my link, so I get credit for it, so why not just use my referral link? Thank you. So when you get in there, you're gonna see that you have different uh, workspaces. So this is a workspace, this is a workspace, and then you can add different bases inside that. So I've got one here that I test and I kind of play around with. And let's say I just want to open up a new base under my clients here. So you can start with a template. You could import a spreadsheet that you may have from Excel or something like that. You can bring that right in here or you can just start from scratch. So I wanna show you what it looks like to start with a template because there's a lot of them that already have all the features and functionalities that you may want that all you have to do is put in your own data. So we'll click here, start with the template and you can see all of the different templates that you have. So you could just search, let's say I have a uh, uh, event planning or I do wedding planning. I'm gonna go ahead and just search. Well, you can see it under here, event planning, but I could just search for here, wedding. And you can see that it comes up with uh, two templates already that you can use. So I'm gonna click on that. You can see all of the tabs that it has already built into it just by the view, so it lets you do that. So you can see it's got guests, seating charts, supply costs, vendors. And what's cool is you can use different, uh, some of the different features allows you to um, coordinate or re, uh, link or sync these tabs or these tables within each other, okay? So let's just say I wanted to use this table or this, um, this base. So I'm gonna go to use template I'm gonna click on it, and you're gonna see already what all of the cool things that you can do. So when I chose mine for my uh, web design marketing business, I, I adopted one, I took a template, and I kind of just modified it for myself, so I didn't have to recreate all of the features that I wanted. Some of them I did have to kind of tweak and make sure they're custom to myself, but you may not need to do that. So with here, you can see that it's got pictures, um, it's got all different kinds of fields that you, that you can add, okay? So if you double click on any of these, you can see all of the different possible field types that are available to you, okay? Uh, if you wanna add a new one, you can do that over here. Uh, under the guests, you can see that they have dinner. You can add drop downs. And what's cool is if you click on any of these guests, to open up the uh, bar there, you will see that it opens up the actual profile of this guest and you can, you can have a different view of it. What's really cool is you can actually go into different views here. So you can have grid, form, calendar, gallery, Kanban is, um, Kanban, you could probably hear that a lot on the web and it's really, it's just kind of like a card base that allows you to move and manage cards in a very um, easy visual manner. So let's just say I look at it Kanban wise. You can say which single select or collaborate field would you like to use? Let's just say I wanna use dinner. So I'm gonna click done. 
But now I have this view. So all of the clients that are all the, the guests that are going to be eating chicken, you can see them in this row here and I can move them around, um, do all, all different kinds of things. So this is just the option of one of the ways you can import a new uh, base um, or a spreadsheet rather if you're used to Google Sheets or uh, Excel. So you can do it that way. You can always click back up here and go home. So without getting really detailed into it, there's some videos out there through actual Airtable's um, YouTube channel or their website. And there's a forum and there's um, um, a community where you can ask questions and things like that. And also I can, um, I played around with it a little bit so I may have some insight for you as well if you decide to set this up. But anyways, Airtable, I've been able to organize my entire business. So now my business is completely run on free resources. So I have uh, Wave Apps for my invoicing and my payments. I have Freshdesk for my support tickets, which is also free. I have my Airtable, which keeps track of all my clients, their hours, all of that, you name it. I have customized it to just completely run um, and manage all my projects and, and my, my clients. And then I have G Suite, which is my emails and my contacts. And I can send out um, campaigns and things like that through that Cloud HQ, which I have another uh, feature, or I know of another video on that. So four programs I'm using right now that are free that I run my entire business. Um, yes, there are programs out there. There's, they're all in one packages, but you could pay up to, you know, 20, 30, 40, um, 50, even a hundred bucks a month for them. So, um, if you're, if you're on a budget and which my channel is a big business, look on a small business budget. Um, you might want to check out these free programs and help you, uh, organize your business. If you expand and you're, you know, making lots of money and money's really not an issue or you want to really streamline there are different programs out there uh, for uh, all-in-one packages or all-in-one crm systems which i will make another video on that on which ones i think um, are good and affordable for you so that's a whole nother video so this is a a different option this is called Airtable. again look at the link in the show notes click on it if you want to sign up for free play around with it check it out and see you guys next time.